Postcards. How to write a postcard. When people travel around the world, they will send postcards home to family and friends. Today, we're going to imagine that we are in a different country and we'll be writing a postcard to a friend or family. This link, Postcards from Birdie, if you click on this link, it will send you to different examples of postcards from Birdie, and that will give you some ideas. An example is Birdie's writing a postcard home to a friend named Floyd. And if you read the postcard, Birdie talks to Floyd about visiting Paris and a very famous landmark in Paris, which is the Eiffel Tower. He also adds a special information, and that's what year was the Eiffel Tower built in, and that was 1889. Another example we can look at is when Bertie writes a postcard to his friend Tutu. He writes from Mount Kilimanjaro and tells him about his adventure. And he adds a little bit of information to make it fun and personable. He also mentions where he's going to visit next. When you're writing your postcard, it's important to mention who you are writing to, what did you do or what did you see, where, where did you visit, or where are you writing from, and when. Today's date, or whatever date you'd like, you can mark it when you, the date that you are making your postcard. Um, it's also important to mention that when you are writing your postcard, that you make it fun and creative. And if you're unsure of the country that you've chosen, do a little research online to find out what that country is famous for. For example, Italy is famous for pasta and pizza. Paris is known for the Eiffel Tower. Things like that. This is an example I found online to help you structure your postcard. So if you follow this guide, it will help give your postcard structure. So don't forget the date, who you're writing to, where you're writing from, what city or what country, and a cool thing, a few cool things you've done. Cool thing one, two, and three. Then you can finish it off by writing, missing you tons, and sending you lots of love from whatever country you chose. Or you could make it, you can make it different. You don't have to write missing you tons. Make it special. And then, of course, sign it at the end with your name. This is um, a picture of a postcard, and you can find this all over online. And don't forget that on a postcard, you can only write on the left-hand side. For example, like this. Don't write on this side. Where will you travel to? Thank you.